why the two hottest U.S. startups in payments might collaborate to marginalize Visa and MasterCard. Quartz. Loading. At import URL HTTP colon slash slash app dot qt dot com slash css slash not js dot css. Obsessions. Login. Register. Log out. Settings. Daily brief signup. About quartz. Twitter IPO Energy Shocks Explosive Growth Mobile Web The Sea China's Transition New U.S. Economy The Cloud Euro Crunch How We Buy Digital Money Debt Future The Finance Borders Space Business Ebernomics U.S. Emigration Bitcoin Now Reading Stories by Search Results for Top News Sponsored by Filters Top News Latest Popular Start Our Obsessions Twitter IPO Energy Shocks Explosive Growth Mobile Web The Sea China's Transition New U.S. Economy The Cloud Euro Crunch How We Buy Digital Money Debt Future The Finance Borders Space Business Ebernomics U.S. Emigration Bitcoin Twitter IPO Energy Shocks Explosive Growth Mobile Web The Sea China's Transition New U.S. Economy The Cloud Euro Crunch How We Buy Digital Money Debt Future The Finance Borders Space Business Ebernomics U.S. Emigration Bitcoin Twitter IPO Energy Shocks Explosive Growth Mobile Web The Sea China's Transition New U.S. Economy The Cloud Euro Crunch How We Buy Digital Money Debt Future The Finance Borders Space Business Ebernomics U.S. Emigration Bitcoin Twitter IPO Energy Shocks Explosive Growth Mobile Web The Sea China's Transition New U.S. Economy The Cloud Euro Crunch How We Buy Digital Money Debt Future The Finance Borders Space Business Ebernomics U.S. Emigration Bitcoin Sections Ideas Tech Markets Lifestyle V2.4.44 Top Latest Popular Start Sign up Search About Login Account Sync Why the two hottest U.S. startups in payments might collaborate to marginalize Visa and MasterCard By Christopher Mims September 28, 2012 Ben Millef is the founder of Payments Network Dwila Jack Dorsey Wright is the founder of Payment Services Company Square AP Dwila and Square are the two hottest startups challenging Visa and MasterCard's near duopoly on how people pay for things. Most coverage of the two paints them as competitors, though their business models are quite different. But it's almost inevitable that Dwila and Square will team up, not in the merger, but in the mutually beneficial collaboration. They and once they do, they could disrupt retail payment services and euros which move trillions of dollars a year of euros in a way that hasn't been seen since the introduction of the credit card. What Dwila and Square do? Square was the first company to make it possible for ordinary people, rather than just stores, to accept credit cards. Square gives you a little plastic box that plugs into the microphone jack on a smartphone or tablet. It works with most Apple and Android devices.